Hi there! In today's video, I want to share 5 ideas about what we can make from 5 liter bottles. So, when there's no tap water at home, or you don't have one in the workshop or garage, but you need to frequently wash your hands, then try to make a temporary DIY hand washer from a 5 liter bottle. Make a small hole slightly above the bottom of your bottle, then tightly cover the hole with your finger as you fill the bottle with water. Then put on the bottle cap, and our DIY hand washer is ready. We just need to slightly unscrew the bottle cap, wash our hands, and again close the cap. And when the cap is on, the water will stop. And also, we can make a temporary dish rack or a dish dryer from a 5 liter bottle. I think it's a rather crash solution, or for the times when you just moved into a new apartment or a house. But I think this project will work best in a summer kitchen. This dish rack is pretty easy to make. All we need to do is to cut a few openings in the bottle for the dishes. Make the holes the size you want. It all depends on the sizes of the dishes and the bottle itself. And we didn't forget about forks and spoons, so let's make a spot for them too. We cut off the neck, then make a hole in the top for the bottle neck. After that, we put it in. And we can say that our dish rack from a 5 liter bottle is ready. Now, if you're used to carrying full grocery bags and they always dig into your fingers, then try this. We take a handle from a 5 liter bottle and tie it up like that. This idea should make carrying groceries much easier. And it's very easy to take the handle off. By using the handle, we can even carry more than just one bag at a time. And also, it doesn't damage the bag. Oh, and by the way, we can make a key copy from the parts of the bottle closer to the neck. All because the upmost and the lower parts have thicker plastic than the sides. So, we will get a more reliable copy. Me personally, I lose my keys all the time. First, we hold the key over a lighter or, let's say, a candle for some time. We are mostly interested in the soot that must form on it, and not the temperature of the key itself. So now we stick and unstick the tape from the key. Therefore, we get a pattern. Then we place the tape with the image onto our plastic piece. And all that's left is to cut out our new spare key. Now let us test it out. And as we all know, this plastic will not do on its own. So we place it in the keyhole and help it out with a screwdriver. And for desserts, another use for the handles. I think we can use them to easily move pipes, armature and so on. It's especially convenient when there's a lot of thin and long pipes. So we don't need to piece them together, just put on the handles and go. As is, the handles are pretty strong. But just to be sure, we can use two at once. So today's video is over. You're all great, so I don't need to remind you what to do. Just gonna wish you a nice day, and bye!